Hello, this is Angela with Parkers Permaculture. I'm standing in the backyard of my Portland, Oregon permaculture garden. We're in the annual veggie garden. It is late July. I just finished feeding the poultry their dinner and I thought this is a great opportunity to illustrate something that I see quite a bit in local gardening groups. It's a question that folks have about their cucurbits, their summer squash and sometimes their winter squash. Folks will get the leaves of their squash with these white patches on them. And they'll ask, what's going on with my squash? Let me show you another example over here. Here I have a zucchini. You can see I haven't picked any since yesterday. And I need to pick some this evening. And the leaves have this white patterning on it. Folks get concerned, is this a disease process? What's happening? especially when you look at the zucchini right next to it that has leaves that look like this. This is a different variety. This is normal patterning on multiple varieties of cucurbit apepo. You don't need to worry. This is not powdery mildew. Powdery mildew is a normal disease process on your cucurbits when they get old and tired at the end of their lives, but it's not normal this time of year. Do you want to avoid overhead watering of your cucurbits? Here you can see this is a cucurbita maxima. The difference between the two here, normal variation across the genus and across varieties in the same species. Nothing bad going on here. You can tell that it's not powdery mildew because it doesn't wipe off. It is a fairly symmetrical patterning, often along the veins of the leaves. It's quite aesthetic looking, actually. Not a disease process, totally normal. Here's another example of a summer squash that has no patterning on the leaves. This one is a little bit later variety, an Italian variety. Let's take one more look over here. This is tromboncino, which is an Italian squash. It has a light white patterning on the leaves. This here is my beloved sweet meat squash, no patterning. So you can get a whole range of white patterning from very light marking to very prominent marking on your summer squash. And that is all completely normal. Don't need to worry. All right, I'm gonna head out for my run. I hope you all are staying well and safe and I will be back for my permaculture garden tomorrow.